Hello, my peeps, and welcome back to my channel. So, as you can tell from the title of this video, I am finally, finally doing my uh, bando slash uh, twilly collection. So, I have uh, most of the twillies that I have are from Louis Vuitton. I do have uh, one here from Hermes. And then I have um, a couple of, I have a coach, I have three Henry Bendo, and actually, well, this right here is a scarf from Henry Bendo, but I'm going to also include it, and I will be showing you guys um, how I styled this. And um, so I'm going to go ahead and just jump right into this video. So the first one I want to show you is this Twilly right here. And this one right here was af actually gifted to my mom um, when she, uh, last year when she was sick and in the hospital. And one of my subbies, Life is Beautiful, uh, gifted this to my mom. And unfortunately, my mom did not get a chance to use it. It still actually has the tags on it, but um, I am going to enjoy it. And it is this really pretty animal print um uh, Twilly right here. And, um, I just, I love anything that's animal print. And this is like, um, I don't know, kind of like a, I guess maybe like a tiger, tiger design, I would call it. But, um, so this right here is the first one that I, um, want to show you guys. And thank you again. Life is beautiful. Um, this was really very sweet of you to gift this to my mom. So that's the first one. And then I just have a few Henry Bender ones that I haven't, this one I haven't even worn. As you can see, it still has the tags, but it's just this purple one. And you can see it has the uh, Henry Bender, I don't know if you can see it, the insignia. There you go. How it has the H and the Bs in there. And it's just this solid purple color. And actually, this is really long. I mean, this is this is very, very long. This is even longer than uh, any of the uh, Louis Vuitton ones. And then I also have it in this color as well. And it's like this burgundy type print right here that also has the HBs on it as well. And then I have this one right here. I really like this one right here because it has this nice little design to it. This is much shorter, as you can tell, um, than the other two that I showed you. And it has the HB um, insignia right there on both ends. And let's see. On this one, it says Henry Bendel. This one, um, I think it's the year 18... I think that says 1893. I think that's when Henry Bendel was established. And then it just has this pattern on the uh, on the back side of it. And then this one right here is the, uh, this is my one and only coach one that I have. And I will be showing you a picture of how I styled this one right here. And this one still smells nice because I had wore the, um, Baccarat Rouge uh, perfume when I had this one here on and this still smells mighty good if I must say so myself but uh, this is the coach one and it's just this beautiful design right here and I wore it with the really pretty um, it was like a um, dusty pink sweater and you'll see in the video but that's the uh, coach one and then it just has the horse and carriage on the back. That's the design all the way on the uh, on the back of it. So that's the coach one. And now I'm going to go ahead and jump into, um, actually, let me show you the one um, um, Hermes one that I have. I really, really love Hermes's Twillies. They are so pretty. I love the vibrant colors of them. <coughs> of course, I love the little box that it comes in but this is the one I've worn this before and I'm going to show you I mean I've had this now for several years but this is the name of it this is the information that's on it anyway if you can see that but I don't even think I've had this for several years now so I don't think that they even have this this one right here is really short this one is probably 
Let's see how long it is, if it's as long as the Henry Bendel ones. And yeah, it's about as long as the Henry Bendel one. It's not as wide. This is a, a thinner one. But anyway, um, so this is, let me show you what it looks like. I just love this orange color here. But this right here is what the uh, twilly looks like. And you can see how vibrant and bright the colors are. And then this is the other side of it here. But just really, really beautiful. I would like to get some more of their twillies. Like I said, they're not very long, but um, but they're really very, very beautiful. So that's my one and only Hermes one. Now I'm going to go ahead and jump into the Louis Vuitton, which I have several of the Louis Vuitton ones. And I'll try to leave the name because I can't remember the names of these at all. And um, I have some that are called the BB size, which are the thinner ones and um which are like this right here let me just show you this one right here and let me see i had the name of this one i had it somewhere here i don't know what i did with it but um oh here it is right here this is the name this one right here this is the name of it i believe they still have it on the uh, website as well. But let me just share with you guys what this one right here looks like. And it says 1854, which is what I believe Louis Vuitton had started. And then this right here just kind of tells a history. Um, the lady in the store, when I purchased it, she was sharing that with me. So I'm just gonna kind of show you all the different things, you know, the history, kind of like the history, I believe anyway. You know, you, of all the different stuff, Louis Vuitton here. But this right here was is really, really another beautiful bandeau. And then on the back side, it just has this design with the, like these uh, flowers on them. And um, it has the uh, Louis Vuitton right there. But this is really beautiful. I mean, you know, you can wear it on either side. Well, sometimes I like to have, whereas both, you know, you can see both. But I just kind of want to show you, you can kind of see how, um, this is the regular Louis Vuitton bandeaux. You can see the difference. This right here is the BB size and how it's more narrow than this one right here is. So, and as far as length goes, let's see. So they're about the same length. So it's just more the width. And you can kind of see, you can see how the other one is wider. But um, so let me share with you guys. This is the regular size one. And there's a difference in price too. The BB ones are, I don't know, maybe about five, maybe about five dollars cheaper, I think, five to ten dollars cheaper than the regular ones. And I know they've gone up in price. So um, I don't know how much long. I, I don't know if they're 200 and 210 dollars i kind of leave the, the price but and then this one here is this one again i don't remember the name i will leave the name somewhere here so you can see but this is really really beautiful and um, i will be showing you pictures of how some of them how i styled them in different ways and then this is the other side i think it's kind of Maybe kind of similar, I don't know, a little similar, I think, on, on both sides. But I just love the colors. You know I love red, and this red and this pink is just absolutely gorgeous. So, you know, you wear this up against, to me, something white, like a white shirt. And uh, this right here is just going to pop, you know, because all the beautiful colors. That's how I would style this, is up against a white shirt. I wouldn't do a red shirt just because I think white would just, this would just stand out a lot more. So that's this one right here. So I showed you guys this one and then this one here. And then this one is here is called the Leo Graham. I do remember that. And I will show you how I styled this one. A lot of times I'll put them, you know, around my neck and make it like a, like, like a, do like a tie. 
and then have it come straight down. And then sometimes I'll pull it off to the side and kind of tie a bow around my neck. I know some people wear them in their hair. I don't have a lot of hair, so I don't know. I don't think it would look really good. I think people will have more fuller hair. I just think it looks better on them. Um, but that's just how I feel. And this one right here, like I said, it's called the Leo Graham. It has Louis Vuitton right there. But I like this one because you can see it kind of has like some animal print in it. And like I said, I just love anything that's animal print. And this one in the picture that I'm going to show you guys, um, I had on, again, a white shirt, I think black pants. I had just came back from church and I have a picture of it. With, and this is the BB one because you can see it's narrow. And then on the other side, it's just the monogram, monogram uh, design all the way down. Yeah, and then you have that black and brown right there. That's really nice. And then this one right here, uh, I can't remember the name of it. Again, I'll leave the name. This one I wore, and I think I have a picture of myself. I wore this one as a bracelet. You know, I just tied it, you know, wrapped it around my wrist like so. And... um well, I'm not doing a very good job, but you kind of get the idea. And then I just tied it. But um, but I believe I have a picture of how I uh, wore this one. And it has Louis Vuitton down there at the bottom. And then this right here is what this one looks like. And this one is also a BB one because, again, it's narrow. So that's how this one looks. And then this is the other side of it has Louis Vuitton down there and you know that flower I don't know the name you know the name of the flower but it has like those flower designs that Louis Vuitton has but that's how this side looks and it doesn't have Louis Vuitton it has it on the flip side but not on this side here so that's that one and then this one right here, this one I haven't even worn because it still has the tag on it. And I was trying to see if I could show you the tag, but I can't because it's kind of, well, let me see here. I don't know. That tag is that, you know, that brown tag is in the way. So I don't think I'm going to be able, I'll, I think I can show you maybe the, you might be able to see the number of it. The style number. But I haven't worn this one yet but this right here is like that uh the the it reminds me of because it has like the eiffel tower here but again i'll leave the name of it the the proper name of it and so this is what this it has louis vuitton and this is the the wider one so this is not the bb one but isn't this just so gorgeous i need to wear this one because it is absolutely stunning i just love again the beautiful colors that it has in it just really, really beautiful. Very beautiful. And then the other side, this is the flip side to it. And I just love these flowers right here. I think it's pretty much the same pattern all the way down there. But again, just another gorgeous bandeau. And it has the Louis Vuitton um, you know, the Y and the L down there, the V and the L, I'm sorry. And that's that. And then this one right here, this one was actually my very first one that I got. And I just kind of wanted to show you how, you know, you can use it on a bag, but this is the, the Steven Sprouse and this is that leopard brand bandeau. Now this one I got off of eBay because by the time I, you know, um, discovered, you know, Louis Vuitton bandos. This one, I don't, they weren't selling anymore. So I got it off of eBay, but, um, I like this. I like this one, how, and you can see it has the Louis Vuitton right there in that pink color, which is really gorgeous. Um, but for some, I, I like, even though, you know, this is Damier Bean print, and I just, I like how this looks against this bag, even though, you know, both are brown. But I like how it looks against the bag. 
Um, so this right here is just another way that you could wear it, you know, to, to as a, um, you know, to embellish your handbags. And I will leave a, um, a link down below on how to tie. I, I, you, I showed how to tie a bandeau. I believe it was around the, um, my coach Cassie, the handles. So I'll leave that video down below in case you want to check that out. So that's how you can uh, use it on your handbags. And then this right here is the, the latest one that I got. And I haven't worn this one either. And this is called the, uh, I think this is the, it's a BB, but it's called the Romance Rose Bandeau. So that's that one. And I have, as you can tell, I haven't worn it. This is the, the very last one that I got. But um, Snow77707, she had showed, she had got a, I think it was like a zippy wallet. And, um, you know, for like, it was like, I guess like their Valentine's collection. And so I'm like, oh, wow. You know, so I said, let me go see if they have a bandeau. And so they did. This is the BB one. And I just, I just fell in love with it. It has Louis Vuitton down there and this pretty hot right there. But again, just really, really beautiful. And um, yeah, I haven't worn it, but I, I plan to, especially now that, um, you know, my church is, they're allowing people back in church. Not a lot, just 35 uh, for right now. Um, but, you know, I get to, you know, wear my clothes again. So, uh, and then this right here is the other side of it, and it just has Louis Vuitton there. So let me just kind of show you. This is the other side. And again, I think the pattern is pretty much the same. All down below, the whole, whole way down. And it has Louis Vuitton. No, it doesn't say Louis Vuitton right there. It just says, does it say Louis Vuitton? Oh yeah, just on this end it says Louis Vuitton. But yeah, so that is my entire bandeau collection. And like I said, this right here is, uh, I got this from Henry Bendo. I'm so glad I got it. And I, this is big. This is more like, this is a scarf. And I'm going to take it off. And just kind of, so you guys can get an idea. But it's kind of like in this diamond type design. But it's, it's big. You know, it's, it's a scarf. It's big. But has, you know, Henry Bendo all along the edges. It says Henry Bendo all around the border, I should say. Henry Bendo is what it says. But um, I will share with you guys how I style this right here. And that's it. That is my entire Bando collection. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Sorry it took me so long to do it. Today is uh, Easter, so happy Resurrection Day to everyone. And um, enjoy, be blessed, stay safe still, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye-bye, guys.